This is Tom Deanhart of BTN.com, and here's a look at the Rutgers at Michigan game. Number one, on a roll, after losing 16 consecutive Big Ten games, the Scarlet Knights have now won two in a row, taking down Illinois and Purdue. The defense has played well the last two weeks. Trevor Morris, K.J. Gray, and Kamoko Ture are just a few of the players who are excelling for this group. It has underrated athletic ability and could pose issues for a struggling Michigan offense. Number two, top tandem. Rutgers has a nice one-two punch at running back in Gus Edwards and Raheem Blackshear. Edwards is a physical back who showed a burst last week with a 74-yard TD scamper, while Blackshear is a speedy freshman who took a swing pass 35 yards to Pater versus Purdue. If these two can get traction, it could open passing lanes for a struggling Rutgers aerial attack. Number three, where's the offense? Michigan's attack continues to struggle for consistency. Last week in a loss at Penn State, the Wolverines never got the rushing game going, and that put too much pressure on quarterback John O'Corn. As a result, Michigan didn't score a point in the second half of a 42-13 blowout loss to Penn State. Number four, shredded defense. The vaunted Michigan defense brought a gaudy resume to State College PA last Saturday night and it got ripped to shreds by a dynamic Penn State offense. How will the defensive coordinator Don Brown respond to this evisceration? This is a talented unit led by Devin Bush, Maurice Hurst, and Chase Winovich, but it was rocked to its foundations last week. For more, check back to BTN.com.